Okay guys, so let's play the stories of Geffield. This is like my seventh time recording it now. I've just finished it and then it didn't save, so hopefully this one saves. It's really frustrating, however, we're doing it again. Anyway, the last one I did it was perfect run. Especially when there was I think there's a glitch in it as well. So it is very, very frustrating on my behalf, but it doesn't matter. You 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 won't you won't see it, so it's fine for you. Anyway, let's begin. First bit's pretty easy. I'd say it's an adventure map. So it's on the easy side. Took about 13 minutes to complete with a good run, and then I, d I did save. <laughs> However, we carry on, we carry on. So we're going to head to the Cobbled Cavern. A lot of running in this map. I know a few little tips when you respawn. So, especially when you're. Every time you respawn, you'll respawn at the start, so it'll be the Forest of Terrain when you respawn. So if you're top right or top left to wherever you are, just hit a respawn. Fat little respawn and then you're chilling. It'll save you a lot of running basically. It would be nice if there was the speed pads, that would be nice. Got to meet the Cobalt King. Yeah, that. And then we're gonna head we're gonna hit a little respawn. We're gonna head to the broken home of Rius. Ryzen Stern, I think they said. This is probably the longest run off the map, this bit here right here. Is running all the way up there. Kinda sucks, I know. It's quite a long run, however, it'll be worth it when we get there. This is a bit where it's glitched as well, with the broken home of Ryzen Stern, I think they said. That bitch is probably the glitch, most glitchy bit. Hit the quest. Oh, I'm fuming about that. That's so annoying. Oh, well. oh, well, well. Don't matter. Don't matter. That is so loud. Creative playtime. I've probably had about two hours running creative. Keep running. Get that book if you want. I think that's you need five five of them books. I do. I only know where two of them are. But there's one book there. Anyway, the longest run is nearly done. It's quite long. I don't think I had a long guys map. It would, like I said, it would be nice for speed boosts. That would help out so much. Or like teleports as well, that could do. Don't matter though. So now we've got to dig. This bit is glitchy now, guys, so... So we've got to just hit this. Make a noise. And now we have to run all the way around to hit all of them. I think there's only one that does it, but I think you have to hit all of them to make it unglitched, if that makes sense. Spam hit this for a bit. Now we're gonna head back and we're head behind the castle. Hit some more. One here, might as well hit it. Good luck. When you you know you're done when the question mark pops up like there. So it doesn't actually tell you on screen, which is like I said, the glitchiest part. Anyway, keep running. Another one here, might as well hit it. Just for good luck. <laughs> this is supposedly the correct uh, pile. Supposedly. However, it does nothing when you actually hit it. So now we're going to do is head towards the middle here. I'm gonna hit this pile. Last time I hit this pile, it actually worked. So there you go. That, there you go. That pile actually worked it. So is, I don't know if it's that pile or what, because sometimes when I hit that pile, it doesn't work. So you have to hit them all. But like I said, hit them piles like how I did. Now we're gonna head up. Back towards here. Make sure we hand in the quest, and we're gonna hit another fat respawn. Hey, nice little restart. Make sure you don't go back to hub. I've done that as well in one of the recording. <laughs> we'll have to restart the whole thing. Now we're back here. That saves us a lot of time there, guys. So we'll head back down to the cobbled cavern. It's probably the longest run, but quite a long run heading towards this guy. Would be nice if it's closer, but it doesn't matter. Keep 
to Robin. Try, try to get these videos under 10 minutes. It's quite hard though, because, like I said, this is a long map. And this is very frustrating. I have to restart every time. Oh, right, now we keep hitting this. Hit this, hit this one. And it says visit Berg, Glimmon, and Felsen. So this is the Temple of Glimmon, and the village of Felsen, and then the village of Berg. So. Now let's head to this temple first. It's probably the easiest one out of three. First one we're going to do is collect some potion. Seems very easy. Got the quest. Potion is just by this little shrine or whatever you call it. In this bit here, don't worry about the parkour. If you die, if you fall in the water, it doesn't matter. Let's see how good I am at parkour. Yeah. Kind of nasty at parkour. There we go. Okay, it's very easy parkour, I'm Then we've got to head to the village of Felsen. The fairy village of Felsen, should I say. Come up here, down the left. This window of a book here is just there. Right in front of me, I'm looking at my pickaxe. So you're going to hit that book. There's two out of five. I only know where two of them are, unfortunately. Probably if I looked hard enough, I'll probably find some more, but. Here's another one. Hit that if you want. But now we'll head up. So I keep spamming my map. I have to look where I'm going. Here we've got to collect seven little fairy things. I don't, I'm not sure they've got seven diamond silver that's what we're looking for. The first four are really easy. I'll hit these four. One, two, three, four. The one up there is quite hard to get, you'll see in a sec. Um, okay, where are we going? I'm going to climb up, come around here. Come up here, there we go, like that. You can get two in this next bit. You've got to get that one, and then we'll have this house here. Grab that, and the next one is up there. Really hard, this one. Or should I start up there? This one's quite hard to get up to, but I'm sure how to do it. Climb on here, like that. Come up top. Jump across. This one's you gotta be quite slow here. There we go, thousand quest complete. Then we head to the village of Berg. Berg. Berg, should I say? Don't know why I said it like that. So we're actually a minute ahead than I was before in the last uh in the last try, which is quite good. So far so good. Collect quest, and now we want to do is head to all the big trees, guys. So first big tree here. Then you want to pickaxe that. Collect the, the um, wood. Next big tree to your right. There's five trees you got here. Hit that, collect that. Next one just behind this rock. Hit that. Next one through the next section here. You don't have to explore anything. You can if you want, like I said. Or read the story. I'm not reading the story this time. There we go, click that. The final one just here. Now we're gonna hit a nice little respawn. Nice little respawn there guys. And now we'll spawn back up here to head back to the cobbles. So we've saved so much time by doing that. It's actually unbelievable. Nice little tip, like I said. Hopefully it helps you guys out. It certainly helps my uh, my ones out. I try to I try to always keep my videos under ten minutes, like I've said. Just because I prefer it, it's more watchable like that. But this one I think I'll just be just be over ten minutes, it won't be a lot over. Which is kind of annoying, but it doesn't matter. So there's a couple more little quests we have to do which is that luckily doesn't involve running. Luckily. Yeah. Hit this. Turning quest. God. There we go. Hit that. Hit that. Head to, to this portal. Do you want to collect the fragment of, vo of the void? What happened there then? There we go. Wait, what? This is glitched. Oh no. Why is it so glitched? No, it hasn't done me like this. Oh, I know why. I'm an idiot. Wait, why is it glitched? 
No. No way. No way, have I me No. Oh wait, that's why. You gotta collect the quest, I'm an idiot. Please work now. I thought there we go. Oh my god. I thought I was <laughs> so unlucky there. I, I was getting really worried. Well that wasted a bit of time, I'm an idiot. I didn't actually collect the quest, that's probably a good start. Anyway, you wanna head up here? Come around. You take a lot of damage but you do take yeah, you take a take a lot of damage but you have loads of health, so it doesn't actually matter. Collect that, spam square on X on that. And you hear a nice noise. Then you wanna head back to the portal. There we go. Come to Jonah. Turning quest. Hit that. Got the bow. Come back through the same portal. You wanna hit these. There we go. This take this took me three hits last time. Not sure how many hits will take me this time. Is good enough for me and that is the map guys so thank you so much for watching i did save a lot of time anyway thank you guys so much for watching hopefully this video will save and i'll catch you like i said if i helped out please subscribe and like that would be really appreciated and i'll catch you in the next video guys goodbye